on that previous episode, we farmed it. Yep, practicable matching grip, even towards stock interfacer. Yeah, we didn't farm it from Veracitus. We got it from the Seraphender, so that's going to be for today. A lot of fun. We're going to enjoy it before, we, you know, we can because nobody wants to farm a perfect one from Veracitus. Uh, topping up from the Snowman Chest, we got a Lawful Evil Monk. Dude, this thing took so long to get. Uh, all the money shots, so we have that. Trespasser for Pete. We have a Lady Fist for, that was for Pete too. Uh, Berserker, that was for Melee Build, which we're kind of done with now. And a Hoarder from Snowman Chest. Boom. Uh, anyways, here is the build. Currently doing a uh, shotgun build, you know, spam all the interfacer and money shot chains. And yeah, chat, off we go. Let's do it. So today we're going to be taking on another raid boss. And I think that raid boss is going to be Hyperius. Uh, we have the ability to actually do that now. But before we do that, though, we need to gear up a little bit. So first off, let's get a new Rough Rider because level 38. We need the upgrade. Sideman. More stashies. What if there was a thing for future Borderlands where there's a rare chance the enemy can have a giant mustache? And if they do, they drop like good loot or something like a tubby. Bro, that'd be so cool. It'd be something different. So our comment from YouTube for today is from Delivery. Delivery? Delivery? Has there ever been a stream where I don't farm? I said that last video, by the way. Gearless Krieg. Am I a joke to you? Yeah, you know what? It's hard to remember all of your playthroughs. Did I not farm at all for that playthrough? I feel like I would have farmed like the gub or something for fun. Did we really not farm one thing in that playthrough? I don't recall. All right, let's see our newfound power. Dude, that's not even money shot. Okay, I don't have overkill, so that would help a little bit. I don't know, should I bottom grab an overkill? No, we're good. We're good. We're good. Never mind. <laughs> okay, the gun's just like, no, Jolts, you don't need it. Look what I can do. Easy. No, the boats don't live this time. Oh my goodness, dude. I love it. Just the pop sound. It's so good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Infinite money farm. Crip prefix. Matching grip. Look at that. But then Jacob stock. All that recoil. Hammerlock. I feel so sorry for you, bro. I can't be good. Also, save quit. Do the skip. Basically, if you unlock the Skyless Grove in normal mode or TBHM, then you can um, save quit and fast travel straight over. And as you can see here, it's got his grip. Just like that. Like, even without money shot, the interface is huge damage. And it works on anybody, not just Sal. Why is there so many of these guys? They're a pain to kill. And by the way, they give, like, no XP, too. Watch. So, Claptrap is insulting these savages right now. And they're like, get them! And then they turn around to kill me instead. They were mad at Claptrap. Why are they mad at me now? What did I do? <laughs> he said bad things. Let's kill the guy behind us. Huh. I killed something. Even on my super PC, on a game from 2012, money shot chains will like drop your frames. All right, falling around. It is, there we go. Dude, for the first time in a long time, no first run, aw. Level up, dude. All right. Yo, second run, look at that. Uh, no matter one part, Hyperion, TDR, TDR, that's fine. That'll do. Like no matter what, it's an upgrade, so. Drop off the 38. And it's 52. Look at that. Heck yeah. Out of here. Oh, I never put up my farm counter. Again. Oops. So we got to beat Scarlet DLC first. All right, we can do that. Uh, off to Oasis. Let's do it. Uh, you love BL2, but you also love mobility and BL3. Yeah, yeah. The sliding and mantling is like really good. I do like it. But if they added it to this game for Borderlands 2, if they added it in, it wouldn't like really... It wouldn't feel right for me, I guess. This game wasn't meant for like mantling and sliding around. Sliding could be fine, you know, slide behind cover. But mantling, I don't know. It just feels a little bit out of place for this game. You don't have those yellow splats or whatever to like parkour around and whatnot. Dude, you know, I kind of forgot we're playing UVHM, the harder difficulty. It feels like normal mode. <laughs> it really does. Uh, Salvador. Don't worry, we're not doing this build all day. We're going to be switching it up. But for now, we're going to enjoy it. What? He's stuck on the roof. Are you kidding me? Fine. I'll work for my kill. Effort and stuff. Dude, he's gonna jump down when I go up there. I'm calling it right now. Oh my! There. Oh wow, we got it. Huh. What? Jolt selling stuff? Huh? Jolt, you feeling okay? Who hacked your account, bro? Uh, you've met Lionel. How are you, Lionel? Ooh, he's in a mood today. Ooh, Lionel, you okay? Also, you know what? Hold on, let me put on the B shield. What? So if you did not know, if you're in a car or boat or anything, you get amp damage in your car. So the B-Shield's gonna apply to my, uh, my boat. Boom! And then we do the skip. 
Oh, are we gonna make it? No! Aw, we were close. Okay. I didn't have speed there. But we did most of the skip. Duh, skip, dude. Wow! Okay. That was one money shot. And all 27 pellets hitting. I never got the compass piece. What was I doing? I was blabbering away. Whatever. What just happened? He just pulled me back. A cool hidden effect with the interfacer is when he aimed on sight, you don't lose movement speed. See? Like, look at the uh, the grog, for example. You move slow, but interfacer, you don't. Uh, same thing for the greed pistol, too. Kind of cool. Oh. What was that throw? Hyperius is going to be the main focus today. Uh, I don't know how long we're going to be farming for the Norfleet, but I do want to get myself, like, a good Tadler or something. I'm going to try to skip. This could be a bad idea. I don't care. Does skip, dude? Don't pull a one life Maya now. Uh, this feels familiar. <laughs> hold on, hold on. We're not gonna die, bro. He ran away. Wow. One life Maya PTSD. You know, it, it was so long ago. I already forgot about it. Cool. Pop on the B shield. Huh? <gasps> Yo, finally an upgrade. We've had this green one for like ever. Where's it at? Get out of my inventory. Boom. Thank you. Because we don't have the uh, bun of the ancient yet. Boom. I didn't shoot the chest. Exposed. It is time. New name. Let's go. Over on Twitch, we've had a crazy day with the bit, so we'll do that. Bit. Oop. Bit. Uh, door. Got it. Ooh, that's a cool combo. I like it. I like it. All right. Anyways, do the skip. So if you didn't know, you can park the boat through there. Do a skip up here. Also, these lines are like very low quality. I've never noticed that before. So if you didn't know, you can actually come over to the edge here and simply walk off. Don't run off. Walk off and get this chest. Boom. You know, we're coming up on Washburn right now, so I don't see why not. For the heck of it. These things are so much fun. Except I don't have overkill, so let me respect real quick. If we're going to make it work. Dude, it's so shiny. Look at this. The god rays coming off of it. Ah! All right, new build. Boom. Let's go. And I guess we're not getting much out of money shots, so we're going to do... Uh, order? Berserker. Berserker. Ooh, until we get overkill, it kind of sucks. Dude, that ain't bad. Yeah, when you have overkill going off... Oh my goodness. <laughs> I just want to kill everything. Whole mag to kill one loader. I know. It's not like the greatest gun for Salvador, but I'm going to enjoy it. We just found it, so... Hopefully that's enough overkill. Probably not. We're going to suffer, but we'll see what happens. Oh, no, we're good. Splash. Splash. It's a splash. Oh my, is that a double drunk? It might be. Bro, I can't aim. I can't see a thing either. Dude, if this gun doesn't kill uh, Hurley, we're gonna have some problems. Alright. Uh, you got a Quasar from the Loot Midgets. Yo, very nice. Yeah. That's definitely a drop you want to get as a world drop. Because farming the ultimate markets kind of sucks. No! <laughs> okay, that does not count. That does not count. We're not dying to Hurley, alright? We died from the guy before us. Bro, I'm not shooting Hurley at all. No. I'm retrying, alright? No, we didn't die to Hurley. Chat, leave me alone. Stop. Uh. Aw. Hey, there we go. When you match the element. Mm. We're only doing Splasher Blaster for this map, by the way. We got him. All right, back to the build. Splasher Blaster. No. New build. So now we have Overkill, so it should be a lot better. To kill or not to kill the Herbert? Let me know. Wow, Chad. Wow. You guys are uh, quite violent. Dude, Salvador OP, look at that. He touched me and he died. I don't care, we're farming it. Do we need it? Not really, but I want it, okay? We could be here for a while. A long while. And let's farm. Dude, what if first try? But no, we got a uh, stability, right? Wait for it. Right there. What is that? What is that? Just like a, a turtle or something. Our first element, finally, dude. 20 runs for one element. Think about that. <gasps> it has matching grip, chat. I would have preferred shock, but that's fine. Cool. 26 runs for a matching grip uh, flying. Yeah, that wasn't bad, but dude, when you try to farm an element on top of that, it, it just takes so long. Way too long. How did knock on wood originate? Knock on wood so that bad luck doesn't happen. Like, how did that originate? Knocking on wood is thought to come from folklore and ancient Indo-Europeans. They believe that trees were various spirits. Touching a tree would invoke and protect and bless the uh, spirits within. Okay. I see. So by knocking on a tree, get rid of the bad luck. Prevent the bad from happening. Interesting. 
Oh, I forgot. If you look straight up, it breaks your uh, your X and Y axis for your shots. So the interface will go to, like, all over the place. You know, I thought that'd be a lot more. Oh, no. I can't see the grip. It's too shaky. The Hyperion? Not Bandit. Bandit grip. Grip. Yeah, with the range and whatnot, I think we're better off doing B-Shield. Okay, hold on. Uh, you know, we just got that Sandhog, actually. So we can do that in a B-Shield. Oh, yo, we got a sight on it, too. Ah. Dude, the chunks. Top near the mouth. Dude, we're getting lucky with the drunk effects. Alright. Bye. Rip. Yeah, we're not gonna farm it. We'll take whatever. Okay, nothing great. I think right off the bat, we should go to Piper Sanctuary and get ourselves a quad. A quad or like a bushwhack or something. With a lot of pellets. Good. Alright, one more. We're so close. No! It's fine. It is A-OK. -okay. Oh, now you complete. Okay, when I get back from spawning in, whatever, it's fine. <laughs> Hector looks a lot like Zane. Hector? Yo, it's Zane's dad. Yo, what if he picked up the soda and spilled it on the Valky and ruined it? It's like, oh, geez. He doesn't look like Zane. I can see the white hair thing, but like, no. It's not Zane. No! Okay, all right, all right. You know, I saw it and I was like, wait a minute. Dude, he's going in a 362. This is next level. Hold on. No, he broke free. Aww. Bro, I was gonna play the song. I was. He never gave me a chance. Yo, drop the, what is it, Nirvana? You won't do it. 1% drop chance, by the way, for the uh, Nirvana from one of those dudes. He doesn't look nothing like me, man. Maybe a little bit. Maybe just the abs, but everything else now. Not even close. Let's get that quad. Level me up, bro. Thank you. Would it not? Wait, can you get a car through there, actually? Hold on. Oh, you can. Dude, I did not know that. You can get a car actually through that area. Also, you have a launcher. First run? If only. All right, that's fine. So yeah, ideally, if you want to get yourself a uh, fast Hyperius reflection kill, you want all the pellets. So ideally, the quad. Oh! Seven runs? Crit prefix? Huh? And it has matching grip. <laughs> all right, game, if you say so. Luckador is back. Wow, I thought we were going to be here for like an hour. I really did. Or at least half an hour. Uh, all right, next farm is going to be the antagonist. We got to get it. Now, I don't know if I'm going to farm for an 880. I'm going to get at least maybe 800-ish. We'll see what we get first. 620, 700. Nah, we can do a lot better. Oh my. Yeah, we're taking that. We're done. If this over here was Hyperion, it would have been the one. Yeah, I think that's fine. That should be okay. Yep, we're taking it. Boop. All right, that's all we need for the kill. That should be good. You take that, and I will take this. Let's do it. Coming through. First shot. Um, not quite. Oh, I killed a bot. Oh. All right, cool. <laughs> the first shot killed the bot, and the second shot killed uh, Hyperius. Just like that. Basically, we money shot for 18 strong pellets, right? They bounce off his shield, and then off my shield, and then build up damage because antagonist. Bounce off his shield, off my shield, builds up even more damage because antagonist. And it goes back and forth until he dies. Yeah. But you gotta get lucky, which is why you want a bunch of pellets. Oh, evolution. You know what? I'll take that. That could be fun. Would you take a lot of increased damage too? I would, but health gate. Yeah. Thanks to Healthgate, we stop at uh, a sliver of HP for, what is it, two seconds, three seconds? So by the time the damage is built up so much, I'm not gonna die, but he will die. But it is possible it can reflect at the very, very end and end up downing you too. But even if it does, I mean, you still killed the boss, right? Do I have a singularity? I do, cool. Go over there, bye. Look at that, it's so easy, it really is. See what I mean right there? Yeah, yeah, it can, like, delay for so long. And then either hit you or, like, another enemy. Oh! That ain't bad. And you're better, too. What the heck? I'll take that. 33-2. Yo, 34. Look at that. 1% better. Holy crap. We really, really upgraded, huh? Dude, what the heck? And then we ricochet a bot again. Wow. I will say this is not very fast. Like, don't get me wrong. We're killing them fast. But... It's still technically slow. 
if we're gonna get a Norfleet today. Yeah, I was thinking that and finish off Fibber. We could do that. Should we? You know what? We can go back to uh, TVHM and get our Fire Fibber. It'd be so much faster. Let me try one more kill. Beautiful. Look at that. So, ah! Oh, what? <laughs> I don't have my farm up because we weren't gonna farm right now, but I went for one more kill. That's why you always do one more. What the heck? Bandit Grip Shock. So it's gonna be two shot, which is great. Huh? You can't make that up, dude. It's even damage prefix. What the heck? <laughs> Bandit Grip. Mana on sight, rocket speed. This is a really good Norfleet. Okay, Fibber. Let's get it. Boom. Back to TVHM. And we gotta get a Fire Fibber. This could be a lot of farming. 1.7% drop chance. Holy crap. That is insane. It's a 1 in 60, gotcha. Alright, we'll do that. They just reflect kill themselves. Bro. I'm just gonna watch. Hold on, just keep shooting me. Okay, that guy's dead. Take that. I think if you have money shot antagonist, enemies will money shot on their final shot too. If I can see the coins, hold on. Right there, you see that? Hide and shoot, the enemy money shot on the final shot. Why does it do that? I guess because I reflect their bullet, it's reading from my skills and seeing that they have zero mag and they money shot themselves. It's so weird. I don't know why it does it like that. Fibber farm is one of the farms that could take forever. And I'm taking any fire ricochet. I don't care. Any prefix, any grip. Waiting for it. Oh. What? How is that not a one shot? I'm surprised. First try. Boom. Nope. Not even ricochet. Try it again. So for TVHM, we're looking for five damage numbers, right? Yeah, five. A heck of a lot of that. Oh my! Dude, matching grip ricochet damage prefix. Wow. Keep it. I don't need it though. No, I can't. I can't. Well, first fire, but not ricochet. Gonna get corrosion first though? Probably. We're gonna get all the elements except for fire. All right, ricochet slag. There it is. So slag shock. Well, corrosion, even matching grip. Ricochet. I told you. Oh! Okay. It's fine. I'm taking it. I don't care. 44 runs, not bad. Not bad at all. And yeah, let's get a new B-Shield too. No way! Okay, game, you're not gonna do this to me, right? It's neutral. Uh, dude, the game just wanted to troll one more time, huh? Oh, dude, I'm reading chat and we got a B-Shield. Look at that. Uh, oh, I think I saw Bandit on it though. Yeah, it's got Bandit on it. It is 53 though, but... Uh, technically better. We'll take it for now, but we, we gotta keep farming. Oh, another B. Okay. Hold on, hold on. Okay, Anshin and Vladoff. That's a two grade. 53? Yeah, that's fine. That should be good. That is our infinite shot build for the moment. All the fire rate, all the money shot. Kind of all you need. Fire, ricochet, fibber. Any Vladoff launcher. It can be white rarity, whatever. It doesn't matter. Right hand, left hand. B shield, all the fire rate, money shot. And then, uh, yeah, you're going to grab your keep firing, all the money shot, whatnot. You're gonna gun Zerg. Get down to one shot. There. And on the final shot, you're gonna hold down the trigger and then immediately shoot your uh, Vladoff launcher for the free shot. Because every second shot or third shot, right, you get a free shot for Vladoff launcher. But thanks to Salvador, you can transfer it to your Fibber and do this. Ready? Boom. Yeah. Infinite money shot. And with that in mind, yeah, our damage is fine. Boom. Boss. Drop your load and the gun Zerg. And then we uh, leave the arena. That's it. Yeah, it's kind of dumb, I know. <laughs> it's a very, very, like, broken glitch. But if we're going to farm Hyperius fast, we got to do this. I will pick that up because I do want to do some Tatter stuff. Where's the run number? I forget to add runs when I uh, don't save quit, so we're not doing runs. Yeah, we'll end it, we'll end it. Sound good? And... Hornet. Where'd he go? I saw it. There it is. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Right. Bro, what? Hyperion grip and stability too. Can I? Oh, we're full. We're full. Not Norfleet, but dude, we still got to drop the end counts, all right? Oh, hey. We got a Shredder Fire. Look at that. Wait, what? Matching grip. Fiery prefix. Dude, perfect Shredder Fire. The stock could be better, but still. Arguably perfect. See, that could be fun, but the issue is Shredder Fire is not a good gun. 
I mean, if I pop on a B shield, sure, but I don't know. I'll put it there for now. Oh! Dude, another Shredder Fire back to back. That was a back to back kill. Shredder Fire. What kind of grip? Okay, doll grip this time, resolute stability. Cool. I'll take a second Shredder Fire. How about a Norfleet, though? Oh! A fire Shredder Fire. Interesting. I guess I'll keep the fire one because it is fire. I like fire. Tadler. Is it elemental? Hold on. If it is, I'll pick it up. If not, I'll just with. Oh, it's shock. Oh, I gotta go get it. Hold on. Yeah, shock. Ooh. Thank you. Okay. Do I need those? No. We're gonna save quit. Go again. 71. Yo, look at that. A lot better. I was trying to get one in the 70s, so I'm satisfied. Oh, not a shred of fire. Never mind. <gasps> fire Tadler, I see you. Aha. Uh, doll grip on it, though. Kind of sucks. Dude, we got shock, fire, and corrosive. Yeah, if you don't know, Tadler's like really good. High DPS. All right. Oh, we got a perfect retro. I'm picking it up. I don't care. <laughs> Dude, matching grip and gentle. Can we make that work? Before we end the video, I just want to let you guys know that I do stream this on Twitch. You can catch them live from Monday through Friday, 2 p.m. to 6 p.m. CST. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I also hope you guys have a great day. And I will see you in the next one. Peace out.